Good day, everybody. A while back, someone asked a question about uh, an oil leak on a GX390 they had. They had replaced the seals, crankshaft seals, and it still pushed oil out of the seals after that. And I was doing some thinking about it, and um, if the seals are good and the crank is good, um, maybe there's an issue with crank case pressure. And these engines do have a... Um, a crank case ventilation system on them and if you are on this side of the engine if you notice we've got our valve cover and also a tube that runs from our air cleaner or intake system into our our valve cover uh, i have another one here if i flip this over it does come in and you can see like a, a vent i guess it breathes through if you look closely under our valve cover you will also see up in the top corner right up here you can see a hole and it's also on the bottom side and it goes down inside the cylinder head from there if you take a look at this you can see that hole there again here and here if you look on the outside edge of the cylinder head you can see the the casting where it comes down through here here I flip it upside down, I can see I have a port here. That port actually lines up on the block with this port right here, which goes straight down through into the crankcase right here. Now, if this was plugged, it could cause excess pressure in the crankcase because as the piston moves up and down, in the cylinder is going to create pressure as the cylinder comes down and it will create less pressure i guess or not a negative but a less pressure as it goes up if it's blocked there could be a possibility of pressure building up in the crankcase and then pushing oil past those seals just an educated guess but if the crank is good and the seals are good um, i might want to check and make sure that that system is not plugged either the holes through the block, the head, the valve cover, or even this tube, um, or where it goes on to the intake, which is right there. Anyway, uh, let me know if that helps anybody out. Thanks.